it's Jennifer Burgess. Um, yes, I am coming at you looking like crap, but hey, I figure if you can't look like crap on the internet in front of the whole world, who can you look like crap around? So, feast your eyes on this, my friend. <laughs> um, uh, I am 13 weeks pregnant with twins, and if you've been following along, you've got to see that whole process of figuring that out. And um, I'm going to take my glasses off because I see that um, now I don't see anything, but before I could see that my reflection, uh, my computer screen reflection was all that you could see. So anyway, just an update on me and um, how things have been for the last, gosh, I guess four weeks since the last one. Um, I've only gained a couple of pounds uh, on the scale, but um, I consider that a feat because uh, I've been really nauseous. Not actually getting sick, but probably about 70% of the time I'm nauseous. Um, so I just keep eating even though I'm nauseous because I know that the, the babies need it. And clearly they do because I've only gained two pounds and I've been eating like crazy. And uh, they have a mind of their own though. These two um, have uh, they're big fans of uh, the Pizza Hut Pizone. So uh, this video is brought to you by Pizza Hut. <laughs> yeah, I just ordered another one. These people are going to start wondering about me, but um, they basically I'm like on this big carb kick. All I want is carbs, which is kind of makes sense if you think about it because I'm nauseous all the time. And I mean, when I'm sick, I usually want like pasta or bread or, but anyways, they like um, cheese toast, chocolate milk, the aforementioned Pizza Hut Pizones, um, cereal. I'm a big fan of oatmeal squares. Quaker oatmeal squares. It's really good. Um, ramen noodles. I mean, I try to get in some good stuff too. They do like Shakeology, so that's good. Um, I've been, you know, I sell it, so um, I've been, you know, drinking a shake a day forever, but I did take it into my doctor to have her look at it um, for my first appointment, and she was like, yeah, definitely, you know, as long as as long as your stomach likes it, um, it's great for the babies because it has a lot of good stuff in it. So I do get my Shakeology in. Veggies are pretty disgusting to me right now. Um, <laughs> Dodgers in the background there. Um, fruit I like. Um, yeah, so anyway, still really, really tired. I'm hoping that all that stuff's going to go away since this is officially the end of the first trimester. Um, but here is baby A, two pictures of baby A. They basically look the same to me, but it's profile picture, the head with the profile there. This one's not as easy to tell. I think these are the same too. I don't know why they gave me two of everything, but here's baby B down here, the profile, the head and everything, and that's actually the top of baby A's head. Um, but originally when we looked at them, which by the way, oh, they were like moving around and they have hands and stuff now, so that's pretty cool. Um, but when we first saw them today, they were like back, or like one was right in front of the other, and it looked like they were like driving a car. So baby A, I guess, is going to be like a taxi driver, and baby B is going to be rich um, and be chauffeured around. Um, but they think, they're pretty sure that baby A is a boy, because um, they could see something. And baby B, they think they see something, so they think that baby B might be a boy, but they're a little bit less sure about that. So it looks like we're definitely having one boy, if not two. So um, I won't know that for about five or six more weeks, so I'll let everybody know. But let's see. I don't want to make this thing too crazy long, but that's kind of the update with me. Just mainly tired and, and nauseous. <laughs> that's pretty much it. But we're, we're really excited, and it was fun to tell everybody, everybody at Christmas. And my cousin Perry, who's my first cousin, is also pregnant with twins. So I guess it's just going to be crazy next year. Um, and she's only due two weeks after, or not even two weeks after me. So that'll be fun. Um, Brooklyn and Dodger are looking forward to being a brother and sister. So anyway, I guess that's really it. I know it's not really too exciting, but hey, it's a diary. But you're watching it. <laughs> you watched it all the way to the end, so who's the loser now? Anyways, no, I'm just kidding. Love everybody, and um, if you like it, click the like button. Um, I'd love it if you subscribe. Pass it along if you know anybody else having twins or who's pregnant for the first time, and um, I always love to connect with people. So, anyways, I'll talk to you guys later. Peace.